In today's video, I'll be showing you how to extend a volume or increase the disk space of a hard drive and partition in Windows 10 using disk management. You do need to have unallocated space on your hard drive or hard drives to be able to do this. So the first thing we need to do is open up the start menu and you now need to type in disk management and you then need to click on create and format hard disk partitions. You will then end up with a window that looks like this. So this is disk management. As you can see, I do have a lot going on with mine. I have lots of different partitions and hard drives and what have you there. So the first thing we need to do is see if we have any unallocated disk space. So as you can see on my disk zero, I have 97 gig unallocated, which is great because that means I can extend my hard drive using that space. So the first thing I need to do is select my hard drive. So I'm going to select my D drive, which is on disk zero as well. I'm then going to right click and then click on extend folio. You then need to press next and you will now see it's automatically selected that disk unallocated space. Before you go any further though, I would recommend you back up any important data just in case anything was to go wrong. So as you can see, it's selected that unallocated space there. If I don't want to use that space, I could press remove and select the ones that I want to. But since that's the only option, I need to select this one. I can also choose the amount of space that I want to use, but I'm happy to use the full amount. So I can now go ahead and press next. I then need to press finish. And as you can see, that unallocated disk space has now gone and my D drive is extended to 562 gig. So there we go, that is how you extend disk space in Windows 10. If I open up my file explorer now and then go to this PC, you can see my D drive is now 561 gig. So I hope this tutorial has helped you out and you enjoyed it. If it did, click the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.